affiliated Cyrus is uh, an organization that was uh, founded by uh, Taurus Foundation Cyrus and Brownell Specialty Cyrus. Our ideas were to try to brand our product line together for international marketing. So affiliated Cyrus is technically a, an international marketing company that is, uh, is owned and controlled by the three organizations doing a lot of work with China internally and um, the offshoots from that would be Vietnam um, and we're trying to uh, expand into Russia which is also a huge market right now. Um, that's not to take anything away from our South America um, market. That's Argentina's been a great uh, buyer of our uh, goals. Your intermediate champion. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a tremendous show so far here today. These are beautiful young cows. Uh, I like cows that walk extremely well, got great udders, got tremendous frames. But I like cows that look youthful, cows that are going to last. Uh, they need power, but they got to move freely. And I think these cows all exemplify that. They're all dairy cows, they all got beautiful udders on them. I think they all have youthfulness to them. They're outstanding uh, cows, long dairy frames. Uh, let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> In front of me, we've got our junior two-year-old. What a tremendous cow. Extremely long, dairy, open. Really impressive with the depth in, in uh, both fore and rear rib and the openness rib. Tremendous udder on her. It's high, it's wide. It's, it's a, she's the right kind. Our two-year-olds are a beautiful pair. They're different. Our first one's got that width and power and that massive open rib cage on her with a snug udder. The second one, the dairy, all clean, open, and, and angler from the tip of her nose to the tip of our tail. We've got our junior threes, another pair of beautiful cows, a little different. We've got our first one, a tall angler, upstanding cow with all kinds of dairy character from up through her head uh, through down to her rear udder. Then the second place, beautiful balanced cow with just a smacking udder and uh, really a well balanced cow. And then we also pulled out our three year old and she fits in this mix extremely well. Um, got that nice side view and a very useful udder and, and a very dairy cow all the way through. And uh, I guess when we look out here, I guess it's, we said it's easy. It was game over. Uh, there's uh, certain cows people like. And, and uh, there's one that just really grabs it. If you want to pull this senior two-year-old out, she's a I just love this cow. Like I said, she's my kind. She's got that width, the power, and, and that dairy strength, that openness of rib, and that depth of rib. And she's just a big, powerful cow with a beautiful udder. Walks extremely well. And, and it's close now. I think once you get her out of the mix, it's close. But I think if you want to pull this pair of junior three-year-olds out, they're going to be our reserve and honorable mention. It's a close pair. I think it was, it was close over here. Like I said, I love both these cows. But our two-year-old for me just has a little bit nicer front end. She's got more power and width through that front end that I really admire. Uh, she runs uphill maybe a little bit more than this tall uh, junior three-year-old. And I like to bloom all the way through that udder, up to that fore udder. I think it's a little nicer in the fore udder, a little bit more bloom all the way to the top of the rear udder and the black cow, the junior three. And I like to say you can't, I don't think you can deny this pair of uh, junior threes. The second one did just a beautiful udder on it. It's high, it's wide, and it's full. It's three beautiful cows. Congratulations.